All right, how's it going again, everybody? This is Gotta Transform Wall. I have today another Elite Trader Box opening. This is one of the two new ones for Paradox Rift featuring Roaring Moon. Uh, there is an Iron Valiant version for the set. I do not have that currently in my possession, but uh, basically the local target only had this one, so here's this one. <laughs> At some point, I'll get the other one. Uh, this is essentially your typical Elite Trader Box in the Scarlet and Violet era, at least. Uh, there are nine packs inside, uh, deck dividers and sleeves, burn and poison markers, energy packet, dice and damage marker dice, uh, a player guide, which has a picture set list I always like looking at, uh, and this, of course, also has a promo of a Screamtail illustration rare. Uh, well, so I'm looking forward to seeing that, uh, but hopefully we get some good pulls from the packs inside. Let's go ahead and get this open. As I get the littlest piece of the plastic ripped off. <laughs> so. Alright, so just toss that back there for a sec. That will go there. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we got all of those. Uh, code card. There is the sleeves, the promo. We got the sleeves, uh, the energy packet. There is the deck dividers, which I will state again, I do wish they sort of kept the uh, set logo on one side. Because it's just like, do you really need the same picture on both sides? Just one's blown up bigger. <laughs> uh, but that is, I mean, I don't, I, I don't even use these, so I guess it's just, a nitpick at the end of the day. Uh, get the damage dice, including the one clear one with an EX for the one, and then the burn and poison markers. So toss those back in there. Toss that back there. <laughs> uh, first off, we have the player guide, which is just uh, tips and tricks on how to use various cards in the set. But of course, there's the picture set list in the back for every card in the set. I know the Iron Hands cards are something I want to get. It's probably my favorite Paradox Pokemon, so I'd like to see a version of that. Uh, but we obviously got the stuff in the back, like all the really, really nice illustration rares and textured stuff. I, I yeah, again, yeah, like I would like to see some version of Iron Hands. There is also the, uh, like the really funny, uh, EX illustration room where it's just clearly going like wall to wall just bursting through <laughs> you can see all the holes it has made in the various ruin walls I find it funny uh, but yeah there's lots of nice stuff we can get here so I'm hoping we can see something like that here we have the promo which is try and get this out without bending it The problem with it being so flimsy is you have to apply some strength to it, but in doing so, almost sort of like bends the card. It's just difficult to try and make sure you don't bend the card while getting the plastic off. Uh, there's the Scarlet and Violet promo number 65. Living up to its name of Scream Tail, just screaming out into the sky. <laughs> Very funny looking card, I think. Uh, but that is a nice looking promo. And then, of course, we have the code card, which you guys can take damage right out of the thing, interestingly. Uh, but it's thankfully just the code card. So there you go. Pause and take it if you want that. Uh, and I forgot the background almost. We have Sharkon and Bulbasaur there, as always. And then on the right, we have uh, War for Cybertron Sideswipe from the Generations toy line. Uh, an old, another flash from the past kind of figure. Make it a reappearance after a, I don't know how long of a time. <laughs> uh, but let's refocus now on the code. Give that to you guys. There you go. And it's Scarlet and Violet. We do not need to do a trick. So we have Snort, Knackle Stack, Plusle, Dottler, Technical Machine Blindside, Crocolore, Technical Machine Evolution. We have a Nimble. And a Screamtail for the reverses. Very nice. Fitting also with the promo. 
Um, just to show this is this like the original version of the illustration right there. The exact same art. Well, not sorry, not art. Uh, attacks, HP, all that stuff. It's all the same. So those are the reverses. And we have a Milotic. I don't remember if that was a hollow we've already gotten yet. Hopefully it's something I'm missing. Because I would not mind having a new hollow. It could also just be a duplicate. I don't know. I don't remember if that's one I've seen already or not. Alright, next pack. We have a flittle, trubbish, gimme google, wiggle, absol, masquerade, ancient booster energy capsule. Uh, we have a loudred and a panpour for the reverses and a garganackle for the hollow. Armor Rouge pack next. Armor Rogue, Armor Rouge. Tomato, tomato. <laughs> we got Toxel, Lifehard, Wimpod, Elekid, Vanillux, Defiance Vest. Oh, skip the last one on there. Durant. We have a Ferrothorn. Or sorry, Ferro Seed. And Tinkatum for the reverses. And a Morpeko for the hollow. Now the star of the box on this one, the Roaring Moon Pack. Next code. And we'll start this one with a Jirachi, Nackley, Parasol Lady, Porygon 2, Orthworm, Professor Toro's Scenario, Mian Xiao, we have a Yaw Mask, and Doblade for the reverses. And a Palkia for the Hollow. And here's the next code for somebody. Whoever's able to grab it first. We have a Tinkatuff, Trubbish, Crystal, Onyx. Technical, uh, technical Machine Turbo Energize, Wug Trio, Techno Radar. We have a Palkia, a nice rare reverse hollow. I do not believe we've pulled this before. So hopefully that's a new reverse hollow. We have a Cursed Duster and an Iron Hands EX. We got one. Oh, I love that so much. Again, I, I can't. This, this has to be my, my favorite Paradox Pokemon. Because I can't, th I can't think of which one would be, like, more liked in my head. So, I, I, I mean, I'm not, I, either way, I'm thrilled to actually see this here. That is awesome. Very, very nice. I love the card effect with the, the, electric, the, like, the electric effect plus the electricity from Iron Hands. I love this a lot. Very, very awesome pull there. So definitely the best pack so far. <laughs> a rare reverse and a new EX. Being probably the one I want the most. But let's hope there's some more stuff in the box. And keep going. We have a Snorunt, Nacklesack, Plusle, Dottler, Medical Energy, Steeny, Gliscor, we have a Trubbish and a Horsey for the reverses and a Golisabod for the Hollow. Three packs left, so two thirds done. Next code. And next we have Bounce Sweep, Phoebus. Apalm, Pansage, Simipore, Zebstrika, Crocolore. We have a Larry and Nackley for the reverses. And an Armor Rouge EX. Armor Rogue? I, I guess it's Armor Rogue. Rouge would probably be G U E. 
Armorog. <laughs> uh, Armorog EX. I honestly didn't know uh, there was one, I think, now that I think about it. <laughs> but I guess that makes sense because it's on the pack art. Very nice, though. I have not pulled that, to say the least. So a welcome pull for sure. I like that everything so far, pull-wise, has been new. I definitely have more than a few of the EXs, so very easily could be duplicates with those. Those were at least two of the ones I was still missing, though. We have Toxel, Lipard, Wimpod, Elekid, Absol, Simisage, Norman. We have a Dwebble and a Tatsugiri for the reverses. Ooh, okay. <laughs> uh, that is a full art Rourke trainer card. Unfortunately, something I got from my booster box opening, so it's a duplicate full art, which is unfortunate because I think I've just got the three trainers I've pulled so far. No Pokemon or any of the other trainers. So things that we have struck repeated gold <laughs> with a full art pull, but I'll still take it. It's still a nice full art pull in addition to everything else in the box so far. Final pack though. Can we get anything else? Got my fingers crossed. Maybe we can. We'll give out that code. There you go. And our final pack. We have a Mantike, Gavite, Minin, Doblade, Ambipalm, Snorlax Doll, Tinkaton. Ooh, we have an Iron Moth, which is a nice rare reverse hollow. This one I'm not sure if I've gotten yet. I know I have the the hollow. But I don't know if we had the reverse yet. I don't remember either way. Still a very nice rare reverse hollow. We also have a Wimpod for the second reverse. And an Aegislash. I don't I don't think we've gotten this hollow. I don't think we've gotten this hollow, so I will take that. Very nice. Couldn't end on an ultra rare. At least, hopefully, it's a new hollow. Again, I'm feeling 99% sure it's not one we've gotten yet. There's that 1% chance. Maybe it is, and I just generally don't remember it. But I think it's new. Uh, but anyway, for the pulls recap, a uh, couple rare reverses. We had the Palkia and the Iron Moth. This looks really cool with the background effect there. And we had two, oh, you probably should go in the back. <laughs> we had two EX pulls with Armor Rogue EX and Iron Hands EX. Probably my favorite pull of anything here. I really just love Iron Hands. I mean, I've always liked Hariyama. Just having like a robot version of it is still just like as nice. <laughs> uh, but it, this has essentially been a big... Uh, raid Pokemon for me as well, so I've got that, like, game connection with it. Uh, so that's very awesome to see. And we got the Full Art Rourke, which again is something we've already pulled before, but is still a fantastic pull. So yeah, I am very happy with this. And of course, the Scream Tail promo. Some beautiful looking artwork. Just, ah, <laughs> screaming into the sky. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, happy with all that. Hopefully, whenever we pick up the other Elite Trainer box, it can be at least just as nice. Uh, but in the meantime, that is it for this opening. So thank you guys so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more. Have a great day.